Watch this. Yep. Right, let's see what we've got here. Good, no edema. He's maintaining his airway. I'll keep an eye on it. If he deteriorates, I'll intubate. OK, let's give him hydrocortisone, clofenamine and three milligrams of tabutaline. Mm -hmm. Can we also set up an IV aminophylline mean, infusion and some... Nebulized adrenaline? You took the words right out of my mouth. The diagnosis, Dr Winters. Come on. Come on. Uh, well, the um, breath sounds are down on the left side. I think it might be a pneumothorax. Are you telling me or asking me? Telling you. And he needs? An intercostal drain. Before that? Chest x-ray. Right. Can you handle all that? Yeah. Good. Okay. Some kind of gangster, but he's like coffee, like he's dying. What the hell are you doing now? I need to talk. Talk about what? You know. Gives you the right to come round here, eh? I can't let this continue. I don't know what you're talking about, mate. I need my life back. Yeah, well, can you give my sister her life back and all? But if I could stop what happened from happening. Oh, magic one time, is it? I think about it every night. Every night I watch her. I can see her face so clearly. You know what? I'll see we end it here. Now. Sit. Sit! This is Michael Bleeker, 28, dislocated patella, possible fracture. He's had some antinox and a little bit of morphine. If you need it in peds, I'll take this. I want to see my son. Where is he? Uh, we'll find out for him. Is Dixie doing the paperwork? Oh, I'm sorry, Tess. I've already got to run. I want to see my son. Where's my son? Okay. Thank you, Ruth. I'll take it from here. What have we got? Uh, patient is eight-year-old severe asthmatic uh -huh. query. Dr. Winters called this so she can lead. Well, she's not got the experience to deal with a child. Experience has to begin somewhere. Ruth? OK. Yeah, I'll need a chest drain set, please, and five mils of 1% liquid gain. Okay. Maybe we could go out one time after work. Yeah, you and me, come and see me. We'll have breakfast together. Uh, that would be nice. Yes. The thing is, I, I'm kind of seeing someone. Mm. Uh, Alice, you had a call back. Is that Craven? Oh, Zach, uh, have you spoken to him? Uh, no, Zach's been taken to St James Pearls Unit. You OK? You leave me alone. Uh, if you want, I can... No, just get out. You, please. Thank you, Dr. Truman. We'll call you if we need you. Yep. Alice, where's my patient? I just spoke to the GP. He's on antidepressants and he's recently been prescribed painkillers. His friend was her, the one that got him out. <coughs> he's really dropping his sats. Oh. He's becoming cyanosed. It's obviously an obstruction. Let's have a look down there. OK, young man. That's it. Right, let's see. What's happening? No, Faragil edema. Size 5 tube. Can someone please tell me what's happening? Could you please keep quiet if you're going to stay in here? So that's continuing to drop. No. No, it's too severe. I'm going to have to go in with a surgical airway. Can you bag him, Tess, please? Could... OK. Come on. Mr Jordan?
John? What are you doing here, mate? John. I was four years old. My dad got me the first fire engine. I wanted so much to be good. I'm not fit to wear that uniform. Is that why you took the pills? I didn't want to feel the pain. Okay, so you, you wanted to be brave like him? Zach was the only one who listened. He's the only one who understood. And now I've ruined his life. To talk, Mum. To talk. To talk. Have you any idea what you've done to this family? Have you? Ah! <laughs> that is what you have done. Get off her. You said get off her. No, no, please listen. You've got. 